I suppose now is the time for me to say something profound. Nothing comes to mind, let's do it. You know that we come in peace business? Bite me. Colonel Jack O'Neill, Kumbaya. I want to make sure you get one thing right. It's O'Neill, with two L's. O'Neill, two L's. Two L's! Colonel Jack O'Neill, U.S. Air Force, two L's in that. Am I understanding correctly that there really is a Colonel Jack O'Neill in the Air Force? There's another Colonel O'Neill with only one L. He has no sense of humor at all. I served the SGC under a General Hammond. So this Hammond is... Uh... Just a man. Very good, very bald man from Texas. You are Hammond of Texas. 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 A great and strong leader among humans. <laughs> Has Hammond of Texas fallen in battle? No, sir, he's he's fine. <laughs> Suffice to say, you might want to get upstairs and punch one on the old speed dial. My grandchildren? Two, then. I think the president might want to know what the Asgard have in mind for our new ship. Yeah, sir, we can't call it the Enterprise. Why not? Captain Samantha Carter, SGC. Long name. Okay, how about Sam? Sam. Uh, these are my friends. Dr. Daniel Jackson. Doc? Daniel's fine. I am Teal'c. Hammond is insisting SG-1 needs a socio-political nerd to offset our overwhelming coolness. If we get captured, we are hooped. Jackson. Daniel Jackson. Right. From the planet Earth. Okay. We're explorers. What? You see, we're from another planet. From a little planet called Earth. The home of Daniel Jackson. Actually, a, a whole other star system, really. Wait, 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 wait. Another planet. You see, you have a, a large ring back there in an exhibit. It's, it's called a, a Stargate. The United States Air Force has been sending people to other planets. Yes, sir. For the last seven years. That's correct. By means of an alien device. Known as the Stargate. Open the Stargate! Open the gate now! Circle of standing water. The circle of darkness. To the stone ring. The great ring of Abaddon. Astria Porta. The annulus. Annulus. I like that. Dove to heaven. The ring of the gods. Stargate. Stargate. Chapa Eye. Kind of a ring thing. Comes with a dialer. You hit the symbols, it spins around, the lights come on. I will take you to your doorway. Whoa. You made it. You wouldn't believe the things that you can make from the common, simple items lying around your planet. Which reminds me, you're going to need a new microwave. Oh, and you're going to need a new toaster. Gate ship one, you go for launch. Gate ship? Well, it's a ship that goes to the gate, so. Right. What? It's a ship that goes to the gate, gate ship. I am the actual one whom you know as Thor. Oh, come on, you gotta love those guys. This is a sun that Borash is orbiting. It's a regular main sequence star with a core temperature of about 15 million degrees and enough hydrogen to burn for another 5 billion years. Yeah. We want to blow it up. Wow, that's, uh, ambitious. ambitious. <sighs> Something wrong? No. I've never blown up a star before. Well, they say the first one's always the hardest. Did they really blow up a sun? As I understand it, sir. Yes, they did. It's gotta look awfully good on the old resume, eh? All I'm saying, just for the record, this is the wackiest plan we've ever come up with. Wackier than strapping an active Stargate to the bottom of the X-302? Oh, yeah. Wackier than, than blowing up a sun? This may not be possible, you know. Come on, Sam. It can't be any harder than blowing up a sun. You know, you blow up one sun and suddenly everyone expects you to walk on water. Why do you defy me? Because you are not a god. 
You are a parasite within a child. And I despise you. Great I. I am your god! And you will feel my wrath! I die free. This is a good day to die. If we are discovered, you will be brought before Apophis along with us. Well, we'll just have to cross that bridge when we come to it. No. The bridge is too well guarded. No, actually, there I was using a cliche that... We shall have to cross that bridge when we come to it. You know, that particular cliche doesn't always work. Are you considering the same tactic as I? Kyuk, the cliche is, are you thinking what I'm thinking? These and other cliches will be available to you all for one more day of training with me. I'd rather be a thief and alive than honest and dead. It's a cliche, but there it is. I know this is a massive cliche, but... And we don't know you. For all we know, you could be her evil twin. But then we'd be dealing with cliches, and you know how I feel about those. No, actually, you know how I feel about those. <sighs> well, this is a cliche. That guy is a living cliché. Over-the-top cliché bad guy, black cloak, oily skin, kind of spooky. Glowing eyes, cliché behavior, evilness, lion scheming, no good for nothing, slimy, overdressed Sir, style monger. I'd like to try something. I wasn't finished, you know. Welcome back. Thank you, Tavares. Have you contemplated your divine right? We have, Prior. We wish to hear more of your wisdom. It is not my wisdom, but the wisdom of the ages passed on to us by the only true gods. Hallowed are the Ori. Hallowed are the Ori. Hallowed are the Ori. Hallowed are the Ori. Hallowed are the children of the Ori. Hallowed are the Ori. I want to live. I want to experience the universe and I want to eat pie. Who doesn't? You. Me? You is the name of the Gould. Ah, sorry. Thank you. Sorry. You go you. You think you hung us out to dry? I'm not going to touch that, sir. You will be among the system lords attending the meeting. I thought you said he was going in as a slave. The system lord, you. No joke there. Funny. The last one is Lord You. You? I don't every joke, every pun, done to death, seriously. Unless you get cute, in which case there's gonna be killing. I'm not gonna hit you, Mayborn. I'm gonna shoot you. Mayborn, you are an idiot every day of the week. Why couldn't you have just taken one day off? I'm taking this loop off. You ended that sentence with a preposition. Bastard. To who? To whom? By who? It's whom. Actually, sir, it's more like what? What? I propose an exchange. For what? Not what, who? Whatever. Camulus. Who? He doesn't know. He doesn't know. I know. Up, down, charmed, blank. Strange. Sphere, planet, label, name. Following still you, not. The clue for seven down is celestial body, and he wrote Uma Thurman. Okay, 23 across, the atomic weight of boron. The answer is 10. Yes? You wrote the word fat. Colonel Jack O'Neill, Major Samantha Carter, Dr. Daniel Jackson, allow me to introduce to you Lieutenant General Vadrine. Colonel? General? Major? General? Doctor? General? Dr. Michaels, this is Dr. Frazier. Doctor? Doctor? Uh, Doctors Woods and Osborne? Doctor? Doctor. Major? Doctor? Major? Doctor. 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 All right, that's enough. Tell you what, why don't you flip to the end and see how it all turns out? Hmm? 
College football is played on Saturdays, pro on Sundays, and there are no fish in my pond at, at all where I fish. Uh, I think that covers it for me. History will remember your contribution to this. <laughs>